We acknowledge the land we are on is the traditional territory of many nations, including the Mississaugas of the Credit, the Ashkenabek, the Chippewa, the Haudenosaunee, and the Wendat peoples, and is now home to many diverse First Nations, Inuit, and Métis peoples. We also acknowledge that Toronto is covered by Treaty 13 with the Mississaugas of the Credit. Hi, I'm Sharon. And I'm Marcus. And welcome to the Toronto Concert Orchestra's Symphony in the City. Mm -hmm. This is our third concert of our summer series, and it's called Shatter. It will hopefully change some perspectives and maybe challenge some of your ideas. Mm -hmm. So the first piece on our program is Alice Ho's Quest. And this, actually this entire program, uh, whenever we think of classical music and classical composers, we always think of Beethoven, Bach, Mozart, Schubert, Schumann, Dvorak. It goes on and on. list goes on. But our entire program today is all by living composers. Mm -hmm. So all the works are very dramatic and very exciting. And our first one is Alice Ho's Quest. So Alice Ho, um, I'm just going to tell you a little bit about what I know about Alice Ho. For the longest time, she was my friend's mom. Um, I went to high school with her daughter. And turns out she's an internationally renowned composer and one of the strongest voices of Asian Canadian composers alive today. So here's Quest by Alice Ho.
If you're just joining us, this is the Toronto Concert Orchestra Symphony in the City concert season. We just heard Alice Ho's Quest. It's such a cool work because it has a lyrical melody and lots of energy underneath in the lower strings. If you like what you heard, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, find us on Facebook and like us there, and follow us on Instagram. All these things help us out so much. Next on our program is five songs on poems by Marilyn Dumont by Ian Cusson. Uh, this piece was commissioned four years ago by Carrie Stratton. Both Ian Cusson and Marilyn Dumont are of Métis origin, and this piece, this, this creation, really does give a voice to the narrative of the Aboriginal people in our, in, in our country, in Canada. It's sung for us by Rebecca Cuddy, who is also of Métis origin. It's a very important work to us, and we're extremely uh, grateful to have been part of the um, the commissioning process of this. Uh, we hope that you are moved by this as much as we were. This piece was premiered four years ago on tour by the Toronto Concert Orchestra and um, everyone that you're seeing here, all the performers, were part of that original performance ensemble. Mm -hmm. This is such a powerful work. Um, studying the score it was very emotional and of course Rebecca Cuddy plays the role very dramatically and very effectively. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure you'll enjoy this. <laughs>
Shutting off a dripping faucet so there is no leak, no leak, not a drop. No. 
skin tot Blood paint Ochre skin Ash That's such a powerful work, and it's, it's so beautiful. If you've enjoyed what you've been hearing, um, please consider donating to our orchestra. It's a bit cliche to say every little bit helps, but every little bit really does help, whether you're donating $5, $10, $20, or... It's all appreciated. Yeah, even $1,000. Um, every little bit really does go a long way to keeping us being able to keep providing these concerts for you free of charge. Mm -hmm. Next on our program is a real true shatter moment for us for the Toronto Concert Orchestra. This piece, Samuel Bisson's Currency of Time, was written for our late maestro, Kerry Stratton. This was the final gift that he received, final musical gift that he received from a composer. Um, we lost Kerry quite suddenly to ALS and um, his 
passing or his illness was a huge factor in the the creation of this piece so the idea of currency or the idea of time as currency as time as something that's finite is something that um that's a theme that that sam explores and returns to in this piece sam bisson is our composer in residence and we we've performed this piece now a few times um it's a very exciting work because you can hear the seconds ticking away and i i think about time all the time and as you're listening to this uh, you, you know, you can stop and think and wonder and, you know, consider time and what is important in your life and who is important in your life and what you want to spend your life doing and mm -hmm. spending time on. Something really cool about this particular piece is it does play around with the idea of a clock. So you have 12 hours in a clock and it's written for 12 singular voices. Mm -hmm.
Wow, what a thoughtful and introspective work that was. Mm -hmm. um, thank you, Sam Bisson, for writing The Currency of Time. Uh, if you've enjoyed this program and enjoyed some of our previous concerts, uh, please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel, liking us on Facebook, and following us on Instagram. The more followers we have, the more we f appear on uh, suggested feeds, and mm -hmm. you know, we'll, we'll just keep growing. And the links are all down below, mm -hmm. and there's a bell notification. It'll, it'll notify you whenever we have something new. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And that's it for our concert tonight. We're going to tell you a little bit more about what's coming up next. Concert four, which is called Heal, has um, we have a bit of a treat for you. We're, we're departing from just a concert uh, idea. We have a dance instructor. So we're going to learn some very simple, simple enough for us to do. And you um, can follow along you, at home. Yeah, very simple English country dance. And as well as we're, we're playing with the idea of Time heals all, so there's some music that goes along with that too. And following that will be our grand finale concert on August 31st, which will feature a new work by Sam Bisson called Divergimento. Mm -hmm. Which is in Concerto Grosso style and it's really cool. Um, that concert is called Beauty and that will bring everything back to our late maestro, Kerry Stratton. And this is a tribute concert for him and it's, um, it's also centered around the city of Prague and all the musicians who fell in love with Prague and Kerry was one of many many mm. who fell in love with Prague. So mm -hmm. we hope to see you then as well. But until then... Until then, see you Tuesday at 7 p.m. See you then. Bye. Mm -hmm.